Yeah. Before we start this, guys. Go and cup yourself when you take the first bite. Shirts. Kitty. Hey, are you ready to go? Kitty was a little sick the other day, but she looks like she's doing good today. Ready to go, Kitty? Kitty. Hey. Let's go. Yeah. Guys, here's a question. A lot of you guys ask this. Can you make some sort of meal for college students? Um, of course. <laughs> you know, how much do you guys spend in a day or in a week? My guess would be $20 per day or $20 per week. I'm trying to eat up all my leftover and I got some lettuce inside. So if I added this up guys, one, two, maybe half of a chicken, probably three bucks a meal right here. Let's just give it $4 a meal right here. All right, pasta's in, chopped chicken with the skin on. You gotta eat skin, guys, you gotta eat skin. No oil in the pan, guys, because it is a non-stick pan. Go salt, go pepper. Got this onion here, I'm just gonna roughly chop, guys. Into the pool. Mushroom soup from good old great value. Your favorite plate, guys, with your pasta on it. <laughs> pasta on the pizza plate. No parsley, no basil. Cilantro with you guys. Mm, gourmet. Gourmet pasta for cheap and delicious. All right, let's do this, guys. Why not just eat right here, right? I'm that guy that don't like mixing my pasta until the end. I don't want to throw the sauce on now. I like to throw a tad bit on there. Guys, here. Take the first bite. Wait, let me stir this up a bit. Take the first bite of this. Spaghetti and mushroom chicken, I don't know, pasta or whatever it is. Take the first bite of this, guys. Quick time. Nice. That's low. I think all this need now is cheese. Just needs cheese to be very good or Parmesan on top. Mm, 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 mm. Some of you guys told me this. Don't have cheese, get some breadcrumb. Get some olive oil. So I'm just gonna do a dash. Throw in my breadcrumb. I'm gonna do a little salt. A little oregano, paprika. Just toast this up. Let's toast it. I had to take it off the pan because it was continuing toasting. Second time around with the breadcrumbs. <sighs> guys, with the breadcrumbs. Quick time, it's gone. Nice. Hmm. <laughs> Is it better than cheese? Try it. Hmm. It gives us this extra crunch. An extra flavor. Well, you can eat anything in the morning. Wow. Hmm. Hmm. Wow. Here's the thing. You want to save money on Alfredo sauce, mushroom, cream. <laughs> Get yourself a can of mushroom soup. <laughs> Them goof. I forgot all about the head of lettuce. You know what? This is what I'm gonna do. I got one clump of 
ground pork here. Pinch of salt, pinch of pepper. Let's go two tablespoons of this Korean hot pepper spice. A tablespoon of ketchup. Splash of water in. Once cooked down, guys, I got one cup of bean sprouts. I call this salad sloppy joes. <laughs> all right. Guys, back to back eating. I gotta finish all my leftovers before I go to bed. So, salad rolls. So, I'll say this is a healthier version of sloppy joes. Let's get into this. Let me roll one up for you guys. So, I got some of this good old sloppy joe and the bean sprouts. I just wanna tap it. Let me roll this one up. You know what? I think this one's busted. Nope. Take one, put it on this one. All right, guys. Once rolled up, guys, quick time. Nice clap. It's not just salad. <laughs> nice. Wow. Hmm. <laughs> if there was cheese on this, Game over. So this, a little of our sloppy joe. Roll it up. Guys, let's do it. <laughs> We've got you guys. There's no right or wrong way to be eating salad rolls. Just get in your vegetables. <laughs> Look at that, guys. Just ate a whole lot of lettuce. That's what's up. Just gonna gently throw it on <laughs> roll it up hmm you don't even need that much just a tad bit is nice hmm Make a nice bed. Just a nice bed. A dollop of your sloppy joe. Wow. If I had cheese on this, game over. Hmm. <laughs> What a morning breakfast. Got some good fats in, got some good carbs in, got some good protein in, and I got some vegetables in. Hmm. All right guys, next meal of the day. Let's say a Cajun style rice. Throw in a handful of onions, oregano, dry mustard, paprika, chicken bouillon, two tablespoons of butter. Since we're making Cajun rice, and I got the chicken here, Let's fry some chicken. <laughs> so let's season our chicken first. Seasoning salt, paprika, oregano, pepper, guys. Let's just get into the cracks. This is the way Koreans do their chicken. Or not this way, this is pretty much southern style Cajun spice with a Korean style way of frying up chicken. I know, Koreans probably looking over and like, don't tell them, Kwan. I'm gonna do it. They use potato starch. So you wanna coat it good, guys. Once coated, guys, pack it in. Throw it in guys. All right, 10 minutes in, I'm gonna strain it. We're gonna let this cool down for about 10 minutes guys before we start frying them. I'm not gonna even call this Cajun rice because I'll probably get attacked. <laughs> I'll call this seasoned rice. Quan seasoned rice. 
Do you think you can eat more fried chicken than me? Come over, guys. Challenge accepted. Got some rice here, or seasoned rice. Chicken here. Guys, got 14 for you guys. Take the first bite of this. Seasoned rice. Yes, got it. Nice. Hmm. That's well seasoned. All right. Here, chicken with some rice on it. Quick time, guys. Yes, got it. Nice. Wow. Well seasoned. Hmm. Look how juicy that is. Hmm. That's just beautiful. There's so many ways and variation just to make chicken. Wow. Let's get the wing. This is what I want to dig my teeth into. Guys, here. The wing. Quick time, guys. I'm giving you a second bite of this. Let's go ahead. Nice. Wow. This whole chicken cost me five bucks, guys. Five bucks for a uh, five piece? I said that's a good deal. Hmm. Hmm. Something with Uncle Ben's rice. You can season it however you want. Hmm. But when you put butter on it, a whole new level. It's like Uncle Ben's rice is made perfect to season. Like when you try to season Asian rice, it just gets clumpy. Hmm. The beautiful ass, guys. Guys, side ass right there. Quick time. Let's go. Nice. That's what's up. A beautiful tail. Mmm. 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 Forgot about the hot sauce, guys. Just a tad right there. Look at that. Beautiful. Mmm. Like I said, get into the credit. Hmm. That's what's up. <laughs> Potato starch is like light, but it gets really crunchy. Light and crunchy. Wow. You think you can eat more fried chicken than me? Eat the bone too. <laughs> Hot sauce on the thigh. Just like that. Let's do it. Bite right into the bone.
Look at that. Hmm. Some good fried chicken. Wow. Wow. What are you doing? How's your meal? Huh? Huh? A lot of guys say that you guys want to see more of Kitty. Kitty just needs a little trim. Kitty. Professional barber. Haircut. Hey, is she? Look at that haircut, kitty. Come here. Yeah. Look at that haircut, kitty. Oh, who's that? <laughs> Peanut likes to bite kitty. This is what Peanut does every time. You can't. You can't. Dessert guys, I got this. The beautiful egg tart. I got the Portuguese version. So the Portuguese version is more, I'll say, crusted and buttery versus Chinese egg tart. The Chinese egg tart is pretty much inside is more eggy. I don't know. <laughs> Take the first bite of this. The Chinese version. Good time guys. It's fine. Nice. Mmm. I'll say it's more eggy. The crust is kind of buttery too. Hmm. The crust is more, I, I want to say chicken pot pie, if that makes sense. Hmm. Nothing beats the Portuguese one. Way more flakier, way more crustier. Take the first bite of this. Guys, my wife makes the best Portuguese egg tarts. <laughs> I can see her now. Her smile is the cutest. She's out there. Guys, take the first bite of this egg tart. Yes, okay, got it. Nice. Hmm. Definitely. Definitely. Way more buttery. Way more buttery. Hmm. That's why I like it. I like it a lot. It's just. Just truly, truly amazing. Like I said, my wife is out there. She has the cutest smile and makes the best egg tart. Hmm. After I finished eating those Nutella ones, I started craving yan yans. My childhood favorite treat was this, guys. Yan yan. Exactly like the, or oh, this one's the original one versus the Nutella one. This was what's up back when I was younger. Take the first bite of this. Quick time, guys. Nice. Mmm. I remember these sticks were smaller. No, I don't remember. Mmm. <laughs> no. These sticks were smaller and it did not have this in groove here. Last one. We'll call it a day, guys. Mmm. It is not too shabby for all the leftovers today. You know, I kind of like these kind of days because it's like using all the old food, just turning into something. If you guys have old food, never throw it out. Just give it to me. I'll create some for you. Hope you guys enjoy this one. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. Also, guys, don't forget to pick up one of your nice shirts. Or take the first bite one. Like this. Cheers. Peace out.